I'm John Leonard. I'm the executive director of the American Swimming Coaches Association for the past 26 years. Started that role back in 1985. Before that, I was a professional coach in Syracuse, New York, full-time coaching, and then in Lake Forest, Illinois, for full-time coaching there for a few more years, and then down to Fort Lauderdale with the ASCA. I actually am old enough now to have been involved in swimming before there were timing systems, and we actually used to time with the old hand watches. And if anybody can remember how to run a, run a swim meet with, with watches anymore, I'd be absolutely amazed. I've tried to do it a few times, and I can't remember how to do it, which is very embarrassing. Um, about the third or fourth year that I was coaching, probably 1973 uh, or 74, somehow we got magically in the budget a timing, uh, money for a timing system. And we bought Colorado because Colorado had the reputation for being the most reliable time system. And I have to be honest, the first set of pads that we got were a nightmare. Everybody's pads back in 1973 and 74 were a nightmare. The moon had to line up correctly with the planets in order to have everything work, and it would work for about a half an hour. Then you stop 15, the meet for 15 minutes while you change time pads in and out, and it was really hilarious. But it was a wonderfully, the concept was wonderfully effective and efficient. And we knew right away this was the future of swimming, and Colorado time was going to be a huge part of it. Uh, Colorado Time has always had the reputation of being the most reliable pads, the most reliable system right, in the timing universe, and, and we've always been very supportive of that and loved it. Didn't take very many years, and I couldn't tell you exactly when, when all of a sudden Colorado Time became invisible because the pads worked every time, all the time, the system worked every time, all the time, and just like the best officials at a swim meet are invisible, right, the best timing system is also invisible, you never know it's there. You you run a smooth, seamless meet, absolutely perfect, and that's where we are today with Colorado Time. In addition to all the great things now they have for training and other applications, but it still comes down to you want to run a great swim meet, Colorado Time's your company. Technology is one of those things where, again, if it's almost invisible, it's the best. Um, when you can do anything technologically and it doesn't interfere with the flow of what the athlete is trying to accomplish in the water, but you still get the information you need to do a better coaching job, that's fantastic. As soon as you start interfering with the flow of what's going on in the athlete's mind, and then that interferes with what's going on in the athlete's body, and now you've changed the equation. And, and of course, one of the things that people say, every time there's an observer of an experiment, you change the experiment. Well, the less you change the experiment, with technology, the better. The reliability factor, and it, it goes beyond reliability. I, I think um, the trust factor that coaches have with Colorado Time as a company, that the products they come up with are going to be fair, they're going to be um, usable, user friendly. Um, there's a trust factor, I think, and it's hard to express beyond that, that coaches have with Colorado that I think is pretty extraordinary. And I think one of the reasons the co company has prospered for so many years, for four decades now, is because they've always been very open, very honest, very direct with the customer base. Customers appreciate that, and they understand that that kind of honesty is the kind of thing that makes our job easier as coaches. My experience with the people at Colorado Time is that they're always looking for new ideas, actively searching for what they can do to serve people. And they're looking for um, not just ways that their current products can help people, but what new products can they create that's going to help everybody. And, and to me, there are very few companies in swimming. They're not the unique company that does that, but there are very few companies that are actively looking to the future and saying, what can we do to serve people better? Happy anniversary, happy birthday to Colorado Time. It's always been a great company. It seems like it's increasing all the time, the services and the things it can provide to its customers. And that's just a wonderful thing, and swimming appreciates it. Thank you so much.